praise the Lord. And I'm thankful for everyone. No one is excluded. I tell you, I, you know, as you look at the news, and I'm telling you, time is running out. See, so many times we look at certain uh, situations and we, we will say something like this, you know, I know I do. Well, this person, you know, shouldn't be doing this and shouldn't be doing that. But sometimes those things are ordained of God. Man, the evil man. Sometimes it's fulfilling the word of God. But the thing with, I'm just going to say us, it's a sad thing to be in truth. God bring you to the truth. And you do not obey it. That's dangerous. I was able to see today, yet I looked into the scriptures, the one that I was studying on today, I looked in, into them before. But I was able to see, and I, I, I started to call someone, but I never called no one. And I wanted to tell them, now I really know why I be bothered. It is simply because the time we're living in. Dangerous time. But God has already said it. But I'm thankful tonight for the word of God. I'm telling you people, it will do things for you that you cannot do for yourself if you believe it. We must believe it. We must trust it. You find yourself wondering sometimes when we should be trusting. Amen. Amen. But I am so thankful for the word of God. Amen. 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 It will bring comfort Amen. to your inner man. Amen. Flesh could still be torn asunder. Amen. But the word of God will bring comfort Amen. to your inner man. And there are so many things, so many things in the word of God which allows us to know what time we are living in. I want to just bow my head and say, God, I thank you. For your word. I'm telling you, the word of God is everything. It answers all questions. There is nothing that it does not answer. I thank God tonight again. Thank God for you all. And my prayer is that God will bless bless us all. But in reading the word of God, the word of God allows me
me to know that according to how you are, you cannot even receive the blessings of God. Why? Because you made yourself another way. I praise God. Sometimes I say truly, truly, God is speaking to us. He's trying to get us to see. Amen. Which he's been trying to get us to see. But he's trying to get us to see before it is too late. And let us turn our Bibles to Second Timothy, the third chapter. to read verse 1. This know also that in the last days perilous times shall, shall come. Thank you, Jesus. For well, a thought tonight, the apostasy is here. This know also that in the last days, perilous time shall come, and they are here. Dangerous time, grievous time, troublesome time. They are here. Amen. In the last days, the time of the gospel dispensation, that is the time we are living in. But not just the time of the gospel dispensation, but it is at the close. We are not living in the very closing of the day of grace, which is the church age. That's where we are, my friend. Amen. And I'm telling you, the time we're living in, if we just know, I said, just a little of how and what God word tells us, we would know too. But now, if we are not spiritual minded, if we are calm minded, we still don't know what, what time we are living in. We still don't know who and even who we are and where we are. Sometimes it be with me, I want to actually put the word of God in people. But you see, I can't do that. I cannot even put it in my own children. But it is much danger. We look at time and our surrounding and all the killing all the things that's going on, but we need to look at ourselves. Amen. Amen. Who am I? What am I doing? How am I? Amen. Thank you.
Thank you, Jesus. I tell you, I, and I said, now, Lord, help me to live in a way so God will give me the power that I need to fight through any demon spirit. And demons are real. But I know I need the anointing of God. Right now, meaning that I need God to be with me. That is the anointing of God. If we just tonight will allow God to speak to us as individuals, forget about the person sitting next to you, forget about how you think it is, and ask God, God, you show me me. I guarantee you, if one would do that, they would go out different. There is no doubt about it. You would go out different. But because we made ourselves, as I said on Sunday, we made ourselves a historical God, a God of our own making. And do you know that's, that's real terrible? Amen? But the scripture is saying to us tonight, I want you to know something. There's no also, that in the last days, now we've been living in the last days ever since Jesus came and hung on the cross. The last days begin at that time. But now, and we need to know this, we are living in the very end of the last days. The very end of the church age, which is the day of grace. We're living in the very end. But the Lord is telling us tonight that in the last days, perilous times shall come, and they are already here. Amen. And I, I think I said concerning the uh, apostasy that it is already here. Amen. Amen. But the word apostasy, and I would love for each person, especially those who profess to be saved. But I want all to listen. Apostasy. It means a falling away. Amen. I can see why I believe it's in Peter. I can see why the scripture says that it will be better if you had never known the truth than, and, than to know it and turn from it. To know it and do not do it. Thank you, Jesus. 
It is the act of, listen, professed Christian. The means, and now you were a Christian, said, it is the act, this is the meaning of apostasy. And this is the time that we are living in right now. The act of professed Christian who deliberately reject revealed truth. Like I, I need you to think on that. Like I don't even need to go no further. Maybe you're not getting it as I have gotten it. But I'm going to read that definition again. The act of uh, falling away first. And it is the act of professed Christian who deliberately reject, reveal truth. I tell you, you know what I did? Some people came to my mind. I got my telephone book, and I turned. But I did not call no one. But as I'm reading, I can see people. As I'm reading. And as I said, it is so dangerous to deliberately reject, reveal truth. See, sometimes sin, it comes in the church and it begins to rain from this person to that person. Do not think that you can get away with that. And it is more than saying, well, I find out I wasn't saved. We need to find out what we've done. How many people we've hindered. And even those in whom you say you love so much, which, which are your own. You hindered those very people. Thank you, Jesus. And believe it now, as I study, I found out that an apostate are those who reject the truth. But they do not, amen, leave religion. They don't do that. They must be religious. I said, God, I thank you. They reject things such as the deity of Jesus Christ, and I would say that's, that that is the core of the gospel. And redemption through his atoning and redeeming sacrifice. Now, you, one might say, well, I don't think I rejected that. When one does not truly allow
allow God to save them, yet reveal truth has shone right in your face? You are rejecting the sacrifice that God gave when he gave his son. Amen? We're going to read Philippians chapter 3. I'm so thankful that it is written that many may walk and say that they've been redeemed through his atoning power. But even in the apostles' day, Listen what the Apostle Paul said. Philippians 3 and verse 18. Read it. For many walk of whom I have told you often. For many walk of whom I have told you often. It, it's going to be something when we meet God and we found out we heard so many times how to escape. But yet, because we love self, because we love the lust of the flesh, we mm -hmm. want to please ourselves, ourselves, if it's nothing but getting with someone like you, talking about someone. That's why, amen. It don't have to be fornication. Mm -hmm. You do not have to be a dirty. Right. You do not have to be a homosexual. That's right. Just get on the phone and, and talk and murder someone. Yeah. Amen. We are going to see. The Apostle Paul says, For many walk, mm -hmm. of whom I have told you often. Mm -hmm. And now tell you even weeping. And now I'm telling you even weeping. For some reason I could not. Stop crying, son. Yeah. And I don't cry that much. And there's nothing wrong with crying if your tears in, if you're crying about the right thing. It's good to cry. Yeah. Yeah. That type of crying, God says, I'm going to bottle up the tears yeah. of the saints. Yeah. I'm going to bottle them up. The Lord said, I'm going to put them in a bottle. Yeah. I don't know why he's going to do it, but the scripture says he, he's going to do that. And he said, and now tell you even weeping. Uh -huh. Now these are people that are walking. These are people who are saying that they know God. That's why it scared me. I want you to know it too. It scared me for you. When you are told to be with someone not like you, someone that will hold you accountable if you get wrong. You say, you may never say a word, but I'm sure you do though. I don't care what be said. I'm going to do like I want to do. Go right ahead on. Your blood will not be on my hand because I told you. That's right. Amen. Amen. Now, these are people walking, but in the last part, read that last part. Mm -hmm. 
That they are the enemies of the cross of Christ. That they are the enemy. Now, I didn't say that. That's right. Yet they are walking. They are saying that they know God. That's right. Amen. But the scripture says here mm -hmm. that they are the enemy mm -hmm. of the cross of Christ. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Ain't God good to us? Yes, he is. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. 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 We're going to go to First John. just like going to so many scriptures, but tonight is necessary. First John chapter 4. And we are going to be again reading at verse 1. First John 4 in one. Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. And this, I'm telling you, this bothered me like, like this. Sometimes the devil, then it's obedient. And then people don't even see. That's right. So how are you going to? Amen. And I believe every spirit, but try the spirits, mm -hmm. whether they are, are of God. Mm -hmm. You don't even know who, who is false. That's right. right. And who is who is real. That's right. Amen. Said for many false prophets are gone out into the world. Mm -hmm. Hereby know ye the Spirit of God. Do you hear what it said? Mm -hmm. Hereby know. You need to know. I need to know. Yeah. The Spirit of God. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. You need to know. That's right. Mm -hmm. Every spirit that confesses that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is of God. Every spirit that confesses that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is of God. Meaning that Jesus was equal with God. And he came in the flesh. He came as Jesus, remember? I'm trying to get you to understand. He came as Jesus and he came in the flesh. There was a whole lot of folks during that time did not believe that. But it's a whole lot of folks in our time do not believe it. How do I know that? Because I've seen when people reject truth, reveal truth, they get in trouble. I mean, they, they go to a place, they have no idea where they are, they don't know what they've done, and they refuse to talk about it. They refuse. Amen. Yes, to go into it. Yes. Want to hide. Yes. No, you can't even hide in saying, I know I did wrong. Sometimes you need to tell what you've done. Yes. That's how I know. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Read 
young sister. And every spirit that confesses not that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is not of God. And every then, spirit mm -hmm. Amen. that confesses not that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh mm -hmm. is not of God. That's why we need to sing. Amen. Amen. We need to see. Mm -hmm. And this is that spirit of Antichrist. Oh, and this is that spirit of Antichrist. And I, do you know that the Antichrist spirit is already here and it is working? Yes. It is Amen. gathering up people. Yes. Amen. That's right. Hope I can say this. Yes. Right. Since I know people can look at me wherever they are. Uh -huh. yes. Thank you, Jesus. But, Lord, help me. Yes. And it's not just in the political world. That's right. Amen. Amen. It is in the church house. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Tell you that that is a spirit that we cannot deal with without God. Amen. And this is that spirit of Antichrist. Mm -hmm. Whereof you have heard that it should come. Mm -hmm. And even now already is it in the world. Already way back in the apostles' day was already in the world then. How prevalent it is in our day. It's everywhere you look. That is if you can see. Amen. The church is filled with anti. Amen. It is filled to the brim. And you cannot tell them. Thank you, Jesus. I was there too. Yes. But God brought me out. Yes. I needed to say that. Oh, yes. You cannot tell them that they are not saved because they are in a church, has been baptized in water, have their name on the church road. And they think that gives them salvation. That's right. But it does not. I'm telling you, we need to try the spirit by the spirit to see whether or not they, they are of God. Are you glad about Jesus? Second Peter. Second Peter 2 and 1. See, people have actually made religion. It almost, uh, I thank God they cannot make real religion this way, but religion, I tell you, it's just like, it's just like you're going to the juke joint. You cannot even tell the difference between a saved person and an unsaved person. They all look alike. Amen. But this way of not going through what God has said we should go through and especially to those of us who 
teach the gospel. Amen, especially to us. Listen what it says in 2 Peter chapter 2 and verse 1. We're still talking about how um, they would reject the redemption through the atoning and redeeming sacrifice, which is that when God gave his son, uh-huh. and his son gave his life. But they going another way. Yeah. Amen. Don't you know I'm glad God saved me? Because I'd be right in it, Sister so Oliver. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Amen. I would be right Amen. in it. Right but God knew. And he did. said, I know those who want the truth. That's yeah. right. Yes, he does. And even those who do not want the truth, because of my love and mercy, yeah. I send you. Yeah. That's right. I send you to a place. That's right. Amen. Where there is truth, yeah. and it is not compromised. That's right. Amen. 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 Verse 1. But there were false prophets also among the people. But there were false prophets. See, it is again. Also among the people. Mm-hmm. Even as there shall be false teachers among you. Uh-huh. Who privately shall bring in damnable heresies. Listen, will not go straight concerning what God has said. Uh-huh. But now you done brought in what? False, um, damnable that- heresies. Uh-huh. Even denying the Lord that bought them. See? You see, there it is. Even denying the Lord that brought them. Uh Lord have mercy. And what? And bring upon themselves swift destruction. And bring upon themselves swift destruction. Thank you, Jesus. And I said on Sunday, and I've said many times before, It, it, it's, it's amazing, but then if you know scripture, if you know spirits, then you know why it is, why it is the way it is. Um, verse 2 says what? And many shall follow their pernicious way. And many, see, that's what I said on Sunday. Mm-hmm. Many shall follow. They will rather follow Evil. That's why they would rather follow another gospel. That's why. Right. Right. Amen. Than to follow truth and righteousness yes. according mm-hmm. to the word of God. Not according to me now, right. but according to the word of God. Mm-hmm. Men would rather that one of the reasons that they would prefer that so they can continue in sin, right. and no one will denounce you. That's right. Amen. Amen. But God has already denounced you. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Mm-hmm. By reason of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. See that? You see? You see? The way of truth. Shall be spoken of. But I want to go back to, at the beginning of verse 2. And many shall follow their pernicious ways. And they will love it. Meaning that word pernicious. Mm-hmm. Meaning that they are destructive ways. Yes. Yes. Many Lord. shall follow their destructive right. ways. Mm-hmm. Oh, I said, Lord, I yes, thank you. Yes, Lord. And read on. By reason of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. isn't that something? Mm -hmm. The way of truth. Mm -hmm. You can go out. You can tell the truth. People will look at you funny. If you stand and you tell the, I mean the, the truth. And then on the other hand, there are those who, I mean, they say anything, people eat it. You hear? Uh, uh, When the truth is told, you can hear a pen fall. When they've changed those damnable 
saying. I mean, they amen and all over the place. See how they love to follow that which is evil. Brother Frank, you got to allow God to help you. God brought you from somewhere. Amen, he did. He did. You should be thundering. Amen. God bless you. Thank you, Jesus. And, uh, and you need to, we'll read, did we read verse, we didn't read verse 3, did we? Read verse 3. And, then and through covetousness mm -hmm. shall they with fans words make merchandise of you. Now, through covetousness shall they with fain words. Mm -hmm. That word means deceptive words. Yeah. Deceitful. Yeah. They will fool you. Yeah. And people eat it. That's why. That's right. And they make merchandise of you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Whose judgment now of a long time lingereth not, yeah. and their damnation slumbereth not. And we don't get back to this. I tell you, you all need to just read this, but I've got to help you yes, as you read it, okay? Yeah. Praise the Lord. Now, apostasy. Differs, D I F F E R S differs uh -huh. from error concerning truth, which may be the result of ignorance. And I'm going to read some scripture to show you. Let us go to Acts 19. Now, this could be um, a result of ignorance. Amen. Or heresy. Let us begin reading at verse 1, 19, Acts 19 and 1. And it came to pass that while Apollos was at Corinth, Paul, having passed through the upper coast, came to Ephesus and finding certain disciples. Mm -hmm. He said unto them, Have ye received the Holy Ghost since ye believe? Now we, we are going to see now that this is different from just Reject and reveal truth. Wow. This is different. Okay? Amen. Read verse 2. He said unto them, Have ye received the Holy Ghost since ye believed? Uh huh. And they said unto him, We have not so much as heard whether there be any Holy Ghost. Uh -huh. You see, they hadn't even heard it. Okay? I'm trying to show the difference. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh huh. And he said unto them, Unto what then were ye baptized? Uh -huh. And they said, Unto John's baptism. Read on. Then said Paul, John verily baptized with the bapti baptism of repentance, saying unto the people that they should believe on him which shall come after him, that is, on Christ Jesus. Uh huh, now. See, they was where they were because of ignorance or heresy. Amen. But when they heard, what did they do? When they heard this, they were baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Amen. Will you praise him? Oh, I said, Lord, I thank you. I wish I could read all these scriptures, but I, I know I can't do that because we'll be here all night, I guess. But we're just so thankful. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. And it could be because you are in the sphere of Satan. 
2 Timothy 2. I'm glad that um, we can we can just uh, look on the screen as you, you know. Second Timothy chapter two. Okay, read it. Uh oh, second Timothy chapter two and verse twenty five and twenty six. In meekness, instructing those that oppose themselves. Uh -huh. If God peradventure will give them repentance to the acknowledging of the truth. Uh -huh. And that they may recover themselves out of the snare of the devil. Recover themselves out of the snare of the devil. See, there he is. Amen. But God was willing to give them repentance. Yes, yes he was. Amen. Uh -huh. Do you praise the Lord? Yes. Are you glad about Amen. Jesus and what he has done for yes. us? Yes. Yes. Read on just a little bit more. Who are taken captive by him at his will. Who are taken captive by him at his will. Yes, Lord. Amen. Amen. Do you praise God? Yes. Thank you, Jesus. And God was willing to give them repentance. Do you praise him? But now, The uh, apostate is perfectly destroyed, and we are going to go there. Amen. In Second Timothy, Second Timothy. Four. Thank you, Jesus. Four and verse three. Now listen, listen. I could hear myself telling, telling the people, listen now. I'm at home though, studying. Listen, so you can get it. Listen now. Verse three. For the time will come. Listen, for the time. Now these are people who deliberately reject revealed truth. Amen. Oh, hallelujah, Jesus. For the time will come. Do you know as a whole now, people do not want truth. That's why. That's why. For the time will come when what? They will not endure sound doctrine. They will not endure sound doctrine. They do not want to hear That's it because right. they want their flesh. That's right. Amen. Amen. Yes, Lord. Whatever it is you might want to do, because see, sometimes people, you hear the word flesh, only thing you think about is sex. Mm -hmm. It's right. way more than that. Way more. Yes, it is. Way more than that. Amen. For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine. Mm -hmm. But what? But after their own lust shall they heap to themselves teachers having itching ears. Listen to what it says. This is what they would rather hear. That's right. I, 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 I know people yeah. have actually, I'm, I'm talking about some people, and I'm not trying to say who. Amen. Amen. But some people, I'm just going to say it like this, have done things to themselves mm -hmm. that they won't be able to come out yeah. of. It is something to reject, reveal truth. Yes. For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine. Mm -hmm. Thank you. But after their own lust, mm -hmm. shall they heat to themselves teachers having itching ears 
Verse 4. And they shall turn away their ears from the truth. And they shall turn away their ear from the truth. It is dangerous when someone tries to come to you to help you. Yeah, that's right. That's and right. tell you just to consider. Yeah, that's right. Consider what I'm saying. Yeah, that's right. We are not each other enemies. Lord, I hope not. Praise the Lord. That's right. But just consider. Yes, yes. That's right. That's right. Yes. What I'm trying to yes, tell you. Yes, Lord. Before you put up that big defense. Yes, that's right. And put up that block. That's yes. right, Lord. Amen. We gonna wish we had. That's, that's right. right. Amen. Amen. And they shall turn away their ears from the truth. Mm -hmm. And what? And shall be turned unto fables. Lord Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes. Who said that? God. Amen. Amen. People actually think yes. they are saved because they can quote a few scriptures. That's, right. That's not salvation. No, it's That's right. not salvation if you can quote the whole Bible That's verbatim. Right. Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 That still doesn't mean you are saved. That's right. You must have the word of God in you. Do you praise him? That is an apostate individual. That is an apostate. Thank you, Jesus. And you know what? An, another thing, an apostate, you know what they will do? That what they will not do. They will depart from the faith, but they will not depart from the outward profession of Christianity. They won't do that. I tell you, apostate, it, I mean, they are, they are bound for hell. Amen. I tell people, Do not reject revealed truth. If you see yourself falling that way, I'm I'm talking about it's time to run in a hurry. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Lord, I need you yes. to help me. Yes. One day you're gonna know I told you the truth yes. too. One day you're gonna know it. I need you to help me. I said, an apostate, they will depart from the faith, but not from the outward profession of Christianity. Thank you, Jesus. Second Timothy, chapter 3. Thank you, Jesus. I'm so glad God's word is it. it it tell us, 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 5, listen. Having a form of godliness. Hey, this is what they'll do. They'll have a form of godliness. Mm -hmm. But denying the power thereof. But denying the power thereof. Denying what God can do for you. Wow. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. That's right. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Having a form of godliness. And I tell you, it is so sad when you tell people the truth. They do not want that, but then they want that form of godliness. That's right. Amen. 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 They continue on as though they are real Christians. Having a form of godliness. But what? But denying the power thereof. And what shall you do? From such turn away. Amen. Yes, Lord. 
Do you praise him? Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Isn't it something to reject, reveal truth? That's something. I said on different occasions, if you do that, please don't stay too long. Because, see, we cannot do nothing with Satan. He knows exactly how to come. He knows exactly what to put before you. Thank you, Jesus. He knows. Oh, yes, he does. He knows exactly. Glory to God. What to tell you? He whispered in your ear, he'll tell you something. And when we, or whosoever, reject, reveal truth, now you stand in danger, I mean, of hindering other people even yourself, even your own children, you stand in danger. Because, see, you cannot stand up right for something you do not have in you. You can't do it. You might tell part of it. You might uh, seem, or maybe you think you got it, but you can't do it. I'm telling you, you have a form of God. See, they will not. Amen. They will not depart from uh, religion, even when they depart from true faith. Amen. Do you praise God? And there are apostate teachers. Amen. And they are destroyed. And some scripture we already read, but still, this is how they are destroyed. In 2 Timothy 4 and 3, which we've already read. Mm -hmm. Read it. For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine. Mm -hmm. But after their own lust shall they heat to themselves teachers having itching ears. They want someone who will tell them something That's right. to please how they are. That's right. That's right. Amen. You know, um, it, I tell you, I, I never want to I say, say nothing or put down a person who will just say, I know I'm a sinner. I, that is the person that can be helped. That's right. But that person who made themselves hard, yes. they rejected truth so long, yes. that, I mean, you can't even be pricked. Yes. I'm telling you, it's dangerous. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Then you will say, at the end, you will say, I wish I had listened. Oh, I wish I had listened. They will heed to themselves, teachers, having itching ears. Amen. And we're going to 2 Peter, oh, I know we can't read all of it. 2 Peter chapter 2. Peter chapter 2. Oh, my father. And this 
this is the whole, well, I said the whole chapter, almost the whole chapter from verse 1 through 19, but we're just going to read it quickly, some of it. Verse 1. 2 Peter 2. Verse 1. Verse 1. Yes, mm-hmm. But there were false prophets also among the people, mm-hmm. even as there shall be false teachers among you who privately shall bring in damnable heresies. But I want you to listen. Mm-hmm. Amen. Amen. Mm-hmm. Even denying the Lord that bought them and bring upon themselves swift destruction. We know. And many shall follow their pernicious ways by reason of whom the way of truth shall be evil spoken of. And through covetousness shall they with fange word make merchandise of you whose judgment now of a long time lingereth not, and their damnation slumbereth not. For if God spare not the angels that sin... Now listen. For if God spare not the angels that sin... Mm-hmm. But cast them down to hell... But cast them down to hell... And delivered them into chains of darkness to be reserved unto judgment. And they are still there now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And spare not the old world... But say, nor the eighth person, a preacher of righteousness, bringing in the flood upon the world of the ungodly. Now you see, it's not by the cry. Right. Do you see it? Amen. People run to a cry. And they think Amen. that a big church caused them to be something. That's right. It calls you to be nothing right. if you were not born again. That's right. Amen. Read on. And turning the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah into ashes, condemned them with an overthrow, making them an example unto those that after should live ungodly. Making them an example to all of us. Amen. If you live ungodly. Amen. And, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and delivered just Lot. And delivered just Lot. Vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. That's why I be bothered, so. Yes, ma'am. Amen. And delivered just Lot. Mm-hmm. Because he was vexed with the filthy conversation of the wicked. Mm-hmm. That conversation means the things that they were doing. Yes. Mm-hmm. For that righteous man dwelling among them, in seeing and hearing, vexed his righteous soul. From day to day with their unlawful deeds. Lord Jesus. And then I say, you not bothered? That's right. That's right. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Uh-huh. The Lord knoweth how to deliver the ungodly out of temptation. And he to reserve. He knows how to deliver the godly. I'm sorry. The godly out of temptation. Mm-hmm. And to reserve the unjust unto the day of judgment to be punished. Uh-huh. But chiefly them that walk after the flesh in the lust of uncleanness and despise government. Presumptuous are they. Presumptuous are they. Mm. Self-willed. Self-willed. They are not afraid to speak evil of dignities. They are not, I mean, they are not afraid to speak evil of dignitaries. Mm-hmm. One in choice. Right. And I've seen that. Yes, that's right. Oh, I've seen it so Amen. good. Amen. They talk B. Yes. But... Do not know that they are putting their soul in a predicament to be cursed. Yes. Don't even know it. Why. Read on quickly. Whereas angels, which are greater in power and might, bring not railing accusation against them before the Lord, but these, as natural brute beasts, mm-hmm. made to be taken and destroyed, speak evil of the things that they understand not. Speak evil of the thing they understand not. Amen. Amen. Haven't you seen that? Yes. yes Lord. Maybe you have done it even yourself. Yes, mm-hmm. Amen. Uh huh. And shall utterly perish in their own corruption. And shall utterly perish. I'm so glad no one is getting Amen. away. Amen. Shall utterly perish in their own corruption. Yes, Lord. Mm hmm. And shall receive the reward of unrighteousness, as they that count it pleasure to riot in the daytime. Mm -hmm. Spots they are, and blemishes, Mm -hmm. sporting themselves with their own deceivings, 
while they feast with you. See? Did you all hear that? Yes, Do you want to read that again, yes, sister? And shall receive the reward of unrighteousness as they that counted pleasure to riot in the daytime. Mm -hmm. Spots they are and blemishes, sporting themselves with their own deceiving while they feast with you. Uh huh. Yes, Lord. And listen, I know that happened right here. Yes. Read on, read on. Amen. Having eyes full of adultery and that cannot cease from sin, beguiling unstable souls, a heart they have exercised with covetous practices, cursed children. And, th and then, you know, sometimes people say, well, I, 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 I didn't do anything. Hmm. If you, you might think you didn't That's do anything. That's right. Oh, yes, you Amen. did. Oh, yes, you did. So see, you can know things. That's right. Don't say and nothing. Don't say That's nothing. Right. That's right. But yet, you say you say. That's right. That's right. Amen. You just a guilty. Amen. Yes. Praise the Lord. Apostle Paul tell, tells us that in the book of Romans. Amen. You don't have to do it. That's right. You can just stand back. Yes. That's Amen. Right. That's right. And see others do it, and you don't say and nothing. And you don't say nothing. That's right. Amen. 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 I tell you, and then they all group together. Yes, that's right. They be together, you hear me? That's right. They don't love each other because they don't know how they love. That's right. Amen. Read on. Which have forsaken the right way. Which have forsaken the right way. And are gone astray. And are gone. Mm -hmm. And are gone astray. Uh -huh. Following the way of Balaam, the son of Bozar. Who love the wages of unrighteousness. Who love the wages of unrighteousness. That's how you get caught up. That's right. Because you love unrighteousness. That's right. That's right. Then you don't love God. That's right. You love unrighteousness, that's so right. you, you go with unrighteousness because that's how you are. That's right. Amen. Read on. But was rebuked for his iniquity. The dumb ass speaking with man's voice forbade the madness of the prophet. Mm-hmm. They are, these are wells without water. These are wells without water. Uh -huh. Amen. I tell you, when it was something spoken to me, I, listen. Yeah. This verse here, it didn't even come to my mind. Yes, Lord. But later on, yeah. it came to my mind. I'm talking about it. It spoke so clear. Yes, Lord. And I'm not going to say what what was spoken. Yes, Lord. But it pertained to these scriptures yes. right here. That's right. Amen. These are well without water. Mm -hmm. Amen. Preachers telling you something, but they can't give you nothing. nothing. To, they bring forth life. That's yes. right. That's right. Amen. Uh-huh. Right. Clouds that are carried with a tempest. Uh-huh. To whom the mist of darkness is reserved forever. Listen. To whom the mist of darkness is reserved forever. Oh, I said, Lord, I thank you yes, for not allowing me yes. to reject yes, Lord. revealed truth Amen. to the point. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. I will be destroyed. That's right. Now, that's how it is with most cases. That's, right. that's how it is with these cases we've been reading. And it's Thank you, Jesus. so many other cases. Yes, Lord. Read on. For when they speak great swelling words of vanity, mm -hmm. they allure through the lust of the flesh, through much wantonness, those that were clean escape from them who live in error. Listen, those that were clean escape from them who lived, not just did wrong, mm -hmm. but lived, lived in error. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. While they promised them liberty, they themselves are the servants of corruption. Why they promise you, Amen, that you are okay. That's right. You just you just keep coming to church and just just keep paying your tithes. Uh -huh. The biggest lie the devil ever told. That's right. Amen. Why they promise them liberty? Uh -huh. They themselves are the servants of corruption. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. For of whom a man is overcome, and the same is he brought in bondage. And the same is he is brought in into bondage. Mm -hmm. Do you praise God? Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. 
Thank you, Jesus. It is something to reveal, to reject, reveal truth. And not, not. I know it's a little old time, but I want to go to St. Matthew, chapter 7. These will be our last scriptures. Again, tell you, people who reject reveal truth. Verse 21. Everyone that saith unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven. But he that doeth the will of my Father, which is in heaven. If you do my will, amen, amen. then you are mine. Yes. Uh-huh. Many will say to me in that day, many, Lord, Lord. Many. Mm -hmm. And this many mean most. Yes. Many will say to me in that day. Now, we know when you when a person say, Lord, mm -hmm. you are supposed to be obeying. Right. Because if someone, even in the olden days, if they, they, their service had a Lord over them, they had to obey what's right. What their master told them. But it says, many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord. Mm -hmm. Have we not prophesied in thy have name? Have we not preached in your name? And in thy name have cast out devils? Mm -hmm. And in thy name done many wonderful works? Mm -hmm. And then will I profess unto them, I never knew you. Depart from me, ye that work iniquity. Now you see. They were lost. That's right. Amen. That's right. They were lost. Yes. But they had done all these things and they thought because they told God what they had done. He already knew. But he said, and then will I profess unto them, I never, not that I once knew you and you turned away from me, I never knew you depart from me, you that work iniquity. I'm so thankful. Amen. For the word of God, I tell you sometimes you be, and I be studying sometimes, I look like I go somewhere. Yeah. Look like I be. Yeah. But the word of God is something else. It's something else. And the word of God will find you wherever you are. For God so loved the world, he gave heaven best, that whosoever believeth in him will not perish, but will have life everlasting. May God bless you. And may God keep you and I like God to talk with yeah. something to reject would be a truth. Yeah. After a while, you'll be harder than a stone. Yeah. You'll be like steel. Yeah. Or the hardest thing there is, if steel is not the hardest, you will be as hard as the hardest thing it is, and you will not break. If you Know that God can talk to you. And if he's talking to you, allow him to do whatever is needed. 